Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Hibbs Tutorial. Today we are going to read this fourth chapter of pressure influence and atmospheric pressure in two parts. First part is pressure influence and its transmission. So first thing that we need to learn is about the term thirst. The thirst is like force only, but there is a difference between thirst and force. That is, the force can be applied on the surface in any direction, but thrust is applied in a direction. perpendicular to the surface it makes 90 degree angle okay that's the difference between thrust and pressure thrust and force force can be applied in any direction but thrust that it is applied in the direction perpendicular to the surface now the si unit of thrust is the same as new force that is newton si unit of thrust is newton and cg's unit is dyne one more important thing that thrust is a vector quantity because it is being applied in a particular direction next thing this is very important 1 kg f is equal to 9.8 newton and 1 gf is equal to 980 dyne and this thing we have read in gravitation this is the thing and same thing is here okay suppose that force can be applied in any direction but thrust is applied in a direction perpendicular to the surface normal to the surface okay and it is a vector on quantity why because it is being applied in a particular direction next is pressure pressure is something that we when we uh, exert force this is a pen i am applying force here so it produces pressure okay so pressure is a thrust per unit area of surface the formula is Thrust upon area, or you could say force upon area. You will have read this in your previous classes, and always remember this: thrust is less on large area, while thrust is more on a small area. For example, I have these two things. One is the surface area is very less, whereas the second thing is the surface area is very more. Now I will try these two things. to pass through this page first i will use a compass i will exert a force and here you can see now i will use the nail it doesn't exert any pressure as compared to this point so the effect of the force that are produced using the compass point is more and the effect produced by this uh, small nail whose surface area was more the thrust was the force that i applied was less it produced it produced nothing not a single point it doesn't it didn't pass through the paper same thing as for a school bags why a school bags have a broad strip because that helps it didn't produce more pressure on your shoulder more the area less the pressure will be applied and if you uh, used a rope instead of the broad strip on your back then it will just you you will get hurt because small area the more thrust that's the concept here about pressure now i hope you know the formula of pressure that is force upon area or you could say thrust upon area both are correct force the si unit of force is newton and the uh, si unit of area is meter square so the si unit of pressure that will be newton meter square basically it's newton meter minus 2 because the meet, meter square will go up there and the positive power we convert to negative power pressure is a scalar quantity this you need to remember and these things are very important the si unit of pressure is newton meter square minus 2 and the cg's unit that will be dyne centimeter the cg's unit of force that is dyne and the cg's unit of area is centimeter so that will be dyne centimeter minus 2 and 1 newton meter minus 2 that is directly called the pascal it was named after 
very famous French scientist Blaise Pascal. So you could write that the SI unit of pressure is Pascal or you could write Newton meter. And here is the Celsius unit given. So these units are very important for you to memorize it. Next is factors affecting the pressure. There are it depends on two factors the area and the magnitude of thrust. As I've already told you that if the area is large, then the pressure applied that would be less. As in the case of the bag strips, as I told you, same thing is here. So larger the area, the lesser the press pressure. Next is way of increasing pressure. For increasing pressure, the area that should be less. For example, so this is basically it is a very cheap soft board that I have. Ignoring that, let me tell you. So I have this uh, what we call it soft board pin, and as you can see, the area of this is very small. Okay, now I'm just gonna try to pass it through. So it went easily. Why it went easily? Because the area was small and the pressure exerted by this was great. Small area but high pressure. That's the example given at the end of Newton's arc mod made pointed. So that large pressure is exerted through the pointed ends and they can be driven into a very less effort. That's a very important, that's a very simple thing for way of increasing pressure. If we decrease the area, then the pressure that will increase. Now, how does pressure inside the liquid depends on these three things? So all these are there, the density of liquid acceleration due to gravity. Have you wondered why the sea divers wear a very special suit, black type of suit? Because when you will go deep inside the ocean or sea, the water that will exert a huge amount of pressure on your body. And there are chances that your body can burst. So it's very beneficial to wear the very special suit that the sea divers wears. So the higher the density of liquid, the more the pressure, the more the depth, the more the pressure, and same goes as for acceleration due to gravity. Next is laws of liquid pressure. Now there are five laws and these, these are very important for you to know. First thing that inside the liquid, any liquid, it could be water, Pepsi, anything. So you might have so seen inside these the types of liquids, the pressure that increases uh, with the increase in by depth. Because of water. As I told you that Why? pressure inside the liquid because depends on flavoring. these strings. So if these strings increases, the pressure also increases. They are directly proportional to pressure. So same thing is here. The pressure increases with the increase in depth and the liquid exerts pressure same equal pressure at all the points in all the direction the pressure is same and the pressure at same depth if the depth is for example 10 centim 10 uh, meter or you could let's say 10 feet then now for example you have taken two liquids different liquids one is water and the other is um, let's say uh, kerosene so the pressure in water will be different to the pressure in the kerosene so pressure may it doesn't matter if the both the liquids are depth is sim same but the pressure will be exerted differently in different liquids fifth is a liquid seeks its own level. Now what do you mean by this term? This sentence. Now we know that that liquid does not have a, its definite volume. That what does it does this means. If you take water in a glass, it will take the shape of glass. It will seek its own level. Or if you take the water in a bottle, 
or in a big container the liquid will seek its own level so these are the laws of liquid pressure which are which is very easy next next thing which are we are going to learn these will this will come in terms of the give reasons so it was very easy for it is very important for you to understand the concept here the first consequence is the pressure at a certain depth in sea water is more than that at the same depth in river water why the reason lies in the density see the density of sea water is more because uh, sea water is basically consist of salt that's why the density of sea water is more than the density of river so that's why if the as an as i told you that density increases with the increase in pressure so if the density of sea water is more then the pressure would be more it's logical thing that we have read here that density will density of liquid increases then the pressure will automatically increase same thing is here if the density of sea water is more then the pressure will be more next consequence is wall of a dam is made thicker at the bottom and uh, i can guarantee you that your teacher will give questions from here from give reasons she will she or he will give i guarantee it you will get one question of give reasons and one more thing i have to tell you a uh, news you will decide whether it's a good news or bad news the news is very normal so watch the video till the end because uh, news is concerned with your uh, examination the question paper that will be discussed at the end of the video but first let's see what's the reason for this why the wall of dam is made thicker at the bottom again as we have read that pressure increases with the depth if the depth of the liquid increases then the pressure will increase so let's see here that this is a dam and this is the depth so pressure will increase with the depth of liquid the more the depth the more the pressure so so if a patient is feeling weakness if a patient ha- is weak the doctors recommend glucose and they use a saline stand now have you ever think why the uh, water bag the blood bag or whatever that is is placed high because it's a good supply of water the height of that liquid supply water much better our body our body can suck that glucose or blood bag right that's why it is placed high so that it slides down to the pipe and reach our body the same thing is here now here the third point the acceleration due to gravity that applies here now the water tank they are made at a sufficient height the reason is the greater the height of tank more will the pressure water in the taps of our house the greater the acceleration due to gravity the greater the pressure that is what the reason is here next thing is that i told you that driver suit so as i told you that due to the high, due to the depth of the river high depth of the liquid means high pressure that's why divers they wear a special suit which protects them from the high pressure that is exerted by the liquid on the body the pressure exerted by the liquid is so much that his blood pressure then the blood pressure so to withstand it the diver divers they wear a very special protective suit so the reason is that it high depth means high pressure so to withstand the total pressure the high pressure then they wear diver suit next is size of gas bubble inside water gas bubble inside water what do we mean by that this is the transmission of pressure in liquids the pascal law so pascal law states that 
pressure exerted anywhere in confined liquid that is transmitted equally and diminished in all directions throughout the liquid. That means if you are like for example you have contained a water in a container so the water will exert pressure in all the side equally equal pressure all the side that's what Pascal law states and by this we are going to read about uh, an experiment so here we have a uh, flask which is filled with water and here's a, a piston so when we push this piston the water that will comes out from this points so if we see that these water splashes they reach the same height because water exerts pressure equally in all the direction this diagram states the totally. hence the piston b which is holding the automobile comes back to its original position so now i hope you have understood this uh, part and if you have any question regarding this you can comment me in the comment section and don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is Seven Stories. Thank you so much. And एक news देनी थी कि जो ninth और eleventh के जो board के paper आने वाले थे council से वो अब नहीं आएंगे. तो अब आपकी class teachers या जो भी subject teacher हैं वही आपका question paper बनाएंगे. So I don't think he or she will give this hydraulic machine and hydraulic jack. हाँ बस ये बता सकते हैं uses of uses of principle क्या है बस. And the next part will be uploaded soon. So, till then, stay tuned and stay safe.